Hi, people. I am recording this um, before I think I have announced what game I am difficulty setting. You just start off right on normal, so if you're not warmed up to the game, uh, it's kind of difficult. Um, another reason is because... Uh, oh, you guys can read the text. I'll just talk over this. Um, because... Uh, it's not you can't just slash your way through you have to like block and you have to kind of be tactical on how you approach certain situations um and another reason is because some of the boss fights are just fucking ridiculous and totally unfair but uh yeah this game came out in 2005 i think it has some pretty damn good graphics for 2005 uh i played a little bit through before recording this first part um just because i wanted to get familiar with the game again I played, I think, like, Chapter 3. Um, I mean, I already know what happens, like, and what to expect, but I just wanted to get familiar with it again. And, um... Yeah. Ninja Gaiden 2 came out for Xbox 360, I think, like, 2008, 2009. Uh, it's pretty good. It's not... This, it's not... I would say it's not as fun as this, just because it seems like, in a way, it's a little bit... just. Well, I mean, there's no doubt that it's catered to, like, make it a little bit easier if you need it be, but, because there is, like, an actual easy mode in that game, like, but, um, I don't know, it's just not the same. The graphics in that game are, like, amazing, but it's just, it's just not the same as this one. This is, I, I just, I love this game. This is easily my top, like, ten games for me. Um, so, yeah. I mean, this was like, this was like back in the day when I, there was like no Xbox Live for me. I just was just play the games like this. I'd play games like uh, Need for Speed. And yeah. I mean, for 2005, these graphics are pretty goddamn good. I'm gonna read all these notes just so I can get her to stop talking. And like, I literally just played through this level like half hour ago, so it might go pretty fast. Um, get up there, but it'll it'll slow down a little bit towards like chapter three, I, I believe. And another thing is that um, <laughs> I, I might look really sloppy at the beginning just because the sword, this dra it's called Dragon Sword, it's, uh, it's really not that good of a weapon when it's, whoa, when it's not upgraded and I really, it's just, there's like no combos you can do, so beginnings might be a little sketchy. And I can't counterattack either, so. Shit. Okay, seriously? Um. I'll, gi uh, I'll give you guys kind of a breakdown of the controls, even though I know. Well, first off, oh shit. <sighs> if you if you have the extra Microsoft points, or if you have a few bucks, I suggest you. Uh, pick it up. You can buy it off the marketplace for only 1200 Um. It is a really good game. And, like, this attack right here, where I charge it up, all I have to do is hold Y. Um, if those little yellow things are around, those, it's called Essence. It's basically, like, the currency in the game. It's what I use to, like, buy stuff and upgrade stuff, but you can, um, you can use it to, like, charge your attacks. And, uh, the essence that drops from an enemy that was killed with a charge attack is, like, more than just a regular drop. Um.
I also really like this, this beginning of this game just because you're actually fighting like ninjas as opposed to later in the game where you fight like you fight like demons and stuff and like alien looking things. I mean it's still fun. It's just not the same though. Whoops, I wasted that. Oh, whoops. I apologize if I'm going really fast. I, I've already done this part, so I should. Can't see. Oh, and that's, an, that's another thing. The cameras, the camera angles in this game are really not that good. And, like, you can kind of adjust it with the right stick, but it doesn't really work that well. Like, sometimes your camera gets trapped in a corner, you can't see what's going on. Okay, seriously. Because, like, okay. Some attacks you can't block, and, like, if you can't see what's going on, you don't know what the enemy is doing, so sometimes you just get, like, automatically raped. use my health. That is a thing that increases your health uh, bar, but the trick to that is to only use it when you're about to die because it refills your health and it gives you more of a health bar, so. Try to save those if I can. Oh, why am I getting right? Okay, I need to play a little bit better. Blue ones are health. There's red ones, blue ones, and yellow ones. And the red ones, you'll see uh, or later. You get, you can have like special attacks where you like shoot fire and electricity and ice and stuff like that. That refills your attacks for that kind of stuff. Give me blue. Okay, so I gotta go down here. Health. Um, bats. Serious. Right, I'm just gonna go away. That. Whatever. Okay, get up. Oh my god. These are the camera angles I'm talking about. Like, it was just, it was just not a good look. That thing is really valuable. Like, if your health bar just gets raped and you die, it'll automatically reheal you to full health. Um, so it's pretty damn good. Those ones you really try to save for like boss battles and stuff like that. You can't. Oh, 
we go. Oh shit. save over this um if anybody's noticed or if anybody's played the second one although not too many not too many people like that i talk to have played these games but if anybody's played the second one the ultimate technique in that game charges way faster than this one which i just realized like an hour yeah an hour ago playing it charges so much faster like you have to sit here like it would already be yeah I don't have the second technique yet, but... Oh. Fuck, man. I'm stupid. Oof. I don't know, jumping on that is bad. No, 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 no. I don't have time for you guys. Whoa. I forgot to get this thing. Alright, alright. Take that, take that. Come on. I don't know, for some reason I like it. I like a game if you can run on walls. Like Prince of Persia, you can run on walls, I like it. This game you can run on walls, I like it. I'm gonna fight these guys again just so I can get the the money. I really doubt that I'll die from these clowns. He's honestly the easiest enemies in the game, so... I guess technically you could spam money right here, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna push it. It's good enough. You could just keep on going in and out. That's what she said. In and out. <laughs> Use the key of courage. this fanboy. There's a trick where you can jump and like catch catch the essence like in the air and then by the time you land you'll have a charged ultimate technique but I, I sometimes I can do it sometimes I can't. It's like something like no, you have to like do it when you're like hit it, yeah, like that. I mean, in in battle, I can't just like concentrate like that. Sometimes I can do it. Sometimes I can't. <laughs> I see you have made it this far. Swinging. Remember when I first played this? <laughs> oh shit. Uh, okay, let's be honest. When I first played this, I got my fucking ass kicked. 
course, this was back when I was like 15 years old, so I didn't really have a concept of how to play games correctly. And I'm kind of embarrassed that I have to use this right now. But I don't want to die. What I really don't want is, I don't want to have to use my Talisman of Rebirth, because that's... That's a good thing to have. Seriously? Okay, what? It's gonna rush me. What? Are you serious right now? Oh, yeah. Cool. <sighs> wow, he's being a little bitch right now. Honestly. Uh... Wow. What is this?! Okay, literally the first time I did this, I think I maybe used one health thing. Let's do that the whole time. I'm gonna be a little faggot. was a lot harder than it had to be. Like, literally the first time I beat him in, like, maybe, like, a minute and a half. Ah, the dragon sword. So your father is still in the sacred wilderness. Yes. He has entrusted me with the sword while he continues his training. He never seems satisfied with the power he wields. Someday you will come to understand pursuit of power. Look at his arms. Perhaps, beginning with your training here. And what of the sister blade, the dark dragon? Has he left you in charge of protecting it as well? It remains in the village under the protection of my father's clan. Uh. They will ensure that the sword remains untouched. Um. It's dark power <laughs> seeing. The storyline for Ninja Gaiden games is pretty much the worst storyline ever, like, of all time. But, I mean, they, they put enough story in it to kind of keep the game going, I guess. I mean, it's alright. Just kind of have to play along with it, sort of. It doesn't really make sense at all sometimes. Especially the second Ninja Gaiden 2, holy shit. Alright, so there's chapter 1. Done. Let's see what ranking I get. Head Ninja. I think the top one's Master Ninja. Nin Master Ninja. Wow. 